What's up YouTube, Silver Dragons here, and in this video we're gonna melt down some gold and make our own gold round. Let's do it! Thank you so much for watching my video, I do sincerely appreciate it. I am so incredibly excited for this one because we're melting down gold. I've never melted down gold before in my life, but I have melted down and made lots of stuff out of silver. In fact, roll the slideshow. <laughs> So obviously I'm not a beginner. Now the plan is to take this 24 karat gold, melt it down and pour it into this graphite mold. We're going to use the small round on the left. It's the smallest one I could find. And this is going to be quite interesting because I'm not exactly sure how fast this is going to melt, but I am going to be using my oxygen acetylene torch and we will be melting it in this whip. So I bought a brand new ceramic crucible just for this. Once we get it seasoned, then it's pour time. Now I will be shooting for a quarter ounce pour, so here I am weighing out 0.26 of a troy ounce of gold because some will be lost in the melting process. Next up is seasoning the crucible. I'm using borax to form a glaze on the inside of this piece of ceramic. Now if you don't do this, you're in for a bad time because the gold will literally stick to the ceramic and you'll never get a good pour. That looks good to me. You want just enough to cover the inside, but not so much that it will contaminate the gold. Now I am preheating the crucible and the graphite mold. You want to make sure they're both over 500 degrees before you begin the melting process. After adding the gold to the crucible, I begin to melt it down. Now it actually only took about a minute using my oxygen acetylene torch, but I have the flame turned very, very low and I am using a small tip as well, just so that I don't lose too much gold. Once I have the mold heated up to where I want it and the gold is all nice nice and runny, I simply pour it out. Now we have a little gold button and it actually turned out way better than I thought it was going to. So next up is to test the weight and the purity. Let's see how much gold we lost ends up being 0.254, so we lost about $12 worth of gold. I guess that's not the end of the world. Let's test the purity. I got my Sigma Pro, and we're gonna be using the small wand. Let's see what it comes out to right in the middle. Pure gold, baby, 24 carats, so we're good to go. Next up is flattening the button and then stamping. I decided to use my 20-ton hydraulic press to actually make the gold button into a gold round. Obviously, it needs to be more flat, so here's me squishing it down, and this is what it looks like after it's all flattened out. This is ridiculously cool. I'm loving the way that this is turning out. I mean, I'm making my own gold round here, and and you can actually still even see some of the ripples along the edge. That is awesome. I tried to film me stamping my dragon logo, but the camera fell down, so I missed that shot. Also, I didn't realize how soft gold is compared to silver, and the dragon was stamped a little bit heavier on the right side compared to the left, but it's okay, it's my first try. There we go, stamping completed, 24 karat, one quarter ounce AU. And here is a look at the final product. I am so happy with the way that this turned out. Obviously there's a little bit of room for improvement with the stamping, but really other than that, we got the weight correct. Obviously it's pure gold, so everything worked out. There was no major issues. Here is a quick size comparison, just for reference, my pour next to an American Gold Eagle. Obviously the gold eagle is only 22 karat and it is much thinner but this will just give you a general idea of the size in case anyone is wondering this gold pour is going to go in my deep stack next to my first ever silver pour i actually poured this silver bar back in 2018 so there's a look my first silver and my first gold pours 
ever. I feel like I have come a long way since I made the Port Accord silver bar. Now I have a little gold round to go with it. But speaking of silver, SD Bullion is doing a massive silver giveaway right now. Just click the first link down below in the description. Get ready for SD Bullion's Monster Box sweepstakes that includes 500 silver eagles. You could be the next lucky recipient of a phone call like this. Hi, Paul. This is Dr. Tyler Wall, CEO of SD Bullion. How are you doing today? I'm doing great. Well, I'm calling you to let you know that you won the SD Bullion giveaway of a monster box of Silver Eagles. Well, thank you so much. This really made my day. So click the link below for your chance to win. That's gonna do it for this video. I hope you enjoyed watching me pour my first ever gold pour. It's one quarter ounce and I could not be happier with the way it turned out. So anyway, if you have any questions about pouring in general or any comments, feel free to leave those down below in the comment section. And lastly, I wanna say a massive thank you so much for watching my video and I will see you all in the next one. Gold Dragons out.